It's that time again for the free weekly BBO Instant Tournaments. You get them by clicking on Instant Tournaments and pick the weekly free. And as always, I do this for members of the Mugi Island Duplicate Bridge Club and anybody else who's interested in watching. Uh, I stress Bergen points, not Bergen points, yeah, Bergen hand evaluation Bergen points and counting winners and losers. And then anything else that comes to my mind while I'm playing. This one I'm thinking, well, we want to go to game. I've got a very good hand in support of spades. I do know one thing. I have 15 points, so partner is limited to 15 high card points because nobody can have more points than me. In a real game, you wouldn't know that. And, of course, you would use Jacoby 2 no Trump, which I'm pretty sure their 2 no Trump uh, is. So partner has a singleton heart. I'm a little, I guess singleton diamond might have been better for us. I'm a little less excited than I was, but I'm too good to bid four spades. So I'm going to Q bid four clubs. What's three spades with the robot? 16 plus total points. And four clubs is a Q bid. And 16 or more points. Okay. I've got a, a doubleton and a dub, two doubletons. Let's do the Bergen support points. I've got 15 high card points and a five card suit gets me to 16 Bergen points. In support of partner, I can count a point for each doubleton. I don't get anything for a side four card suit or like I do when I'm declarer. So I'm certainly uh, strong enough to Q bid or to, uh, I think I'll just Q bid. They both show 16 points. I might as well show the club ace in case that fits his hand. Okay, I have three. I think that's five clubs. If you're not sure, you can look at it and see. Yes, it's definitely three or zero, five clubs, six spades. All right, well, there you go. Well, I don't think you underled the the uh, ace of hearts. So let's count our winners. We have six spades, two clubs, and two diamonds. That's uh, that's eight, six, seven, eight, nine. That's ten. I need two more tricks. I can't rough. I can rough a club in my hand to give me one more trick. But I still need one more trick in addition to my club rough or successful queen queen of clubs finesse. So it looks like I'm going to have to find the queen of diamonds or the queen ten of diamonds. Um, anything. It looks like i got to play west for the queen of diamonds. And then I can take six spades and dummy, uh, two clubs, two diamonds, and a two clubs, three diamonds. I'm, gonna, I'm arguing I'm going to find the queen of diamonds. Two clubs, two, three, three diamonds. That's 11 tricks, and a club rough in my hand is 9. I don't see anything else I can try. I could keep the king of hearts as a squeeze card on west. He didn't leave this from the ace, king, queen. So I could pick up the doubleton. Keep the king. I could pick up the doubleton queen over here, but I, I'm going to finesse this guy for the queen. Well, they're going to make me rough out my king of hearts anyway. We're, I, I'm not going to win. Well, there's no, it's theoretically just not very possible. He's got uh, 11, let's see, 10, 10 hearts. 10, 9 hearts. Well, I'm just rough with the king. Just so that he can't, uh, you know, over rough. Also, I'll keep the four as an entry to my six later in the hand if I have to try to set up diamonds with two roughs. You know, we're six four, so the spades will be divided divided three zero or two one. So we'll take a look and see. Okay, they're gonna be two one. I don't know who has the two. We're just gonna continue to unblock the spades. Now they have a boatload of hearts they can throw away, so. I need one spade to run. I need one spade to rough a club. I may need another spade to get back to my hand. So well, 
We need to find the Queen of Diamonds. Whoa, well, that's good. Okay, well, now we can claim. That should be, you know, not... Oops. History. That's better than I thought it was going to be. All right. So the question here do I, is, do I want to open a diamond and rebid a, no uh, uh, a club, two clubs? Or do I want to open one no trump? It's a non-trivial question. I think a no trump is the most descriptive. Although, if you disagree with me on this, that's quite okay. Uh, so I'd open a diamond and rebid two clubs. Well, I don't have any major. Two diamonds. So now we have to decide, is this extra values? 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Actually, wait a minute. I didn't have... Oh, crap. I should have opened a, a diamond. I, I don't have enough values to be... We're, we're overbid already. I should probably open a diamond. He'll bid one of his majors. He's got a major. I'll bid a no trump, but that's where we play. So I'm already in danger. I've already bid this hand. I miscounted my hand. I should have told you how many Bergen points I had, and then I wouldn't have opened this stupid hand. Well, the robots are at a disadvantage. They're going to play me for more points. Well, there's five diamonds. A heart and a club. Five diamonds, a heart and a club. We might... And this is a disaster. This is a disaster. I need to try to steal a trick. The easiest trick to steal is the ace of clubs is in east. I can lead a club towards the king. I take five clubs, five, five diamonds, a club, and two major suit cards. I don't see any reason not to play for that. I keep the, uh, I got all these aces entries. All right, well, having stole one trick, which is always good. Should I try to steal another? Uh, well, 120, let's see what we can make in diamonds. Yeah, we could lose a heart, a club, a spade. We might make four diamonds. Well, this is still not going to be good. I guess I'll just cash out my winners, take my lumps. So I've got three more diamonds. I've won, I got three more diamonds and two aces. That's five more tricks. I'll just claim my five tricks and get my poor result. Yeah. Yeah, I, I miscounted my points. I just looked at the shape, not the points. So um, that kind of brain freeze happens to us all, I guess. And as you can see, you can make four diamonds easy enough. Somebody uh, must have done better because this is four diamonds, four diamonds, four diamonds, four diamonds, four diamonds, four diamonds. No, oh, somebody made five diamonds. Must have led the king of spades. Okay, well, we've got our work cut out for us. Not you. You, you opened a diamond like a normal person. Okay, well, this time I come to 16 points, and I'm going to open a, a no trump, which is the proper bid. Um, Robot had some options there. I think doubles take out. Yeah, I should probably double, but we also have a pretty good hand. Spades and a minor. Miners probably not clubs. Well, 
well, I guess I'll, if my hearts were a little better, say queen, reverse my clubs and my, my hearts, I would double. I think I'll just pass. Well, that's a good look, lead for us. Um, should we try to hide? We could try to hide um, the jack of clubs by playing the queen. Declare we'll be counting our points. He knows like we got at least 15. And he count dummies 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And his. So we know my partner won't have much. But I guess there's no, no need to mislead partner. We'll just make it abundantly clear that we have that suit. So clubs does not declare a suit. So he's got five spades and five diamonds. We want to cut down on Russ and Dummy. Russ has got five diamonds. He only needs one rough, right? Ace of diamonds, give me a diamond. Yeah, rough diamond. So cutting down Dummy Russ is not so important. Well, he, he, this is a seven, so this is some shortness. So partner had a doubleton club at most. One, two, that's four and dummy, four in my hand. Declare would have, four, let's see, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. I hope partner has at least one more club. And he needs a spade, he needs an entry. So the clearer has, he can't have five, the most he can have is four clubs. It's unlikely he bid this with four clubs. So it's got five diamonds, maybe four diamonds, five diamonds, five spades. So we get a pitch on the ace of hearts, he's gonna avoid, eh. I think I'm going to just return a trump. I'm going to get my diamonds. I don't think they're going to go away. Uh, other than the rough and dummy. I'll keep the eight just in case that seven's a threat somehow. If he had two spe two hearts, it would be. He had one heart. So Declare had one heart in his known five diamonds in two clubs. So he's probably has a doubleton club partner led to seven. From, seven from the three doesn't make a lot of sense. Partner still has the king of hearts. Okay, here comes a uh, diamond rough. Yeah, he's got five diamonds. He's rough two hearts, and he's played two rounds of trumps. He's got a trump left. If he only had five, five spades. Oh, I only had four diamonds. All right. And this is my, and this is my. Or did he have a doubleton club? So he's five, five, two, one. And about average. Okay. Not much you can do about that. I, I could have led back to King of Diamonds. It doesn't matter. Any, anything works. Uh, one heart. Well, I could bid, um, I can't bid a no trump. I can't double, I got a doubleton spade and four hearts. So this is a this is a pass, uh, don't make the mistake. I don't mind doubling with, with sort of poor shape. It reversed my majors, I would double a heart, but not with, you know, two spades. And, I mean, it's wrong with the doubleton and the unbid major. Yes. All right, well, partner doesn't have much, the 10 of diamonds.
I don't know if the cleric had the king. He might have tried the queen. I don't know. Maybe not. Partner's probably leading 10 9. He doesn't have the 8. The partner's got a 10 9, then the 7's a big card because I can cover the 8 with a jack. I'm not going to waste it. Waste it here. Uh, don't know if he thinks I'm signaling or not. I don't know what I want him to lead. I have to give count to him, but he doesn't pay any attention. Plain standard count. I jumped up with the 10. Again, I think I want to keep the 9. Same reason as last time. I don't think. Yeah, okay. So, so partner unblocked and hearts. 5, 4, 3, 1. Looks like partner had a double to uh, 9 of diamonds. So I, or he could just be showing the 9. 10, 9. He could still have 3. 3. All right, so um, everybody knows I've got the jack. If I play the jack partner, worry about who's got the seven. I save that one. An honest count, and my partner can over rough that one. All right, so now Declare has roughed three hearts. So I think the plan here is to play the last heart and exit a diamond on the last spade and then play a diamond. Well, Claire's out of hearts, he's out of trumps, he's out of diamonds. So, in case partner's got a stiff queen of clubs, what's that? What he has if he has a stiff queen? Oh, yeah, the 13th trump. Okay, yeah. 50%. Can we do better than down one? Down one, down one, down one, down one, down one, down one, down one. Nope. Okay, well. That board number two's biting us. I got a lot of options. I could bid two clubs. I could bid one no trump. I could double. I like to have at least one four card major when I double. And if if I don't, I'm gonna to have to rebid no trump, and then it shows a bigger hand than I have. Yeah, I just I just got a one no trump bid here. I yeah, I've been no trump without a stopper. Or at least I have one this time. Okay. Another fine mess you got us. Okay, well we're gonna. We need to finesse East for the Jack of Clubs. We're, we're pretty sure he has the Ace of Clubs. Or he's open second seat, yeah. So he could have the Ace of Clubs. I would need to finesse him twice. I need two entries of Dummy. I've got two entries if I don't mind overtaking the King Jack of Diamonds, but I do mind. We'll play one entry in finessing Clubs. And maybe even set up nine as an entry if it... All right, so diamond three looks like third or fourth best. East won't have a five card major. Most he's got two four card majors. Four four, be four four three one with the singleton club. Ugh. That would be bad. I'm gonna keep the king, but I plan to overtake it later. All right, I'm just, uh, they're going to force me when they win the Ace of Clubs in Diamonds, and then I'm going to take my uh, Club Finesse. Well, we're going to take Club Finesse. See how that works. Oh, now I still have the Diamond. 
I saw the diamond entry to dummy. So I'm going to run my clubs and see what we can discover. So East had three clubs and he opened a diamond. I'm going to keep my four hearts there just to oh the jack, the nine. So West had three diamonds. East had, let's do East hands easier. He had four diamonds. No, five diamonds. Five, three, three, two. Five diamonds, three clubs, five, three. So in the majors, he's uh, three, two, one way or the other. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to lead the Cash my diamonds, so two hearts away. Lead the jack of spades. If he covers, great. If he doesn't cover, I'm just taking my ace king. Robots tend to cover, but we'll see if he's if he's man enough to cover. Oh, okay. Well, now we just claim two more tricks. Did that dig us out of the hole? No, we're still, oh, we're moved up to fourth. All right, well. Well, we're too strong for one no trump. In addition to having 18 high card points, we've got a great five card suit and we've got three aces. So we're going to open a club and rebid two no trump, I think. Unless partner bids a spade, in which case we'll bid a lot of spades. I think we still have to bid two no trump. I think one no trump doesn't show with the big hand. Yeah, no, we still have to bid two no trump. East won't have very many points because partners got enough points to bid. Free bid there's we've got what eight. We have eighteen. I could probably bid three no trump. Don't bid two no trump. All right. All right. So this time we're going to definitely want to count their points. So dummy has. Four, five, six, seven, eight. And we have eighteen. That's twenty-six. So they have they have fourteen. And West has most of those fourteen. This is not from the king. Open a club. What the hell's he leading at? He's probably got all the everything and all the other suits, probably. I mean, a club lead into my suit doesn't make a lot of sense. Uh, small, small jack. Don't have the entries over there. Ten, king, ace. He's got the king. Oh, well, what does, this won't work, but we'll try. All right. So there are 14 points. He showed up with three of them already. That leaves him with 11. Any advantage at ducking that one? You don't have to win it. If he has five clubs, it doesn't help us. Ah, I'll win it. So we now think he's got the king of hearts, the king of diamonds, and the king of spades. The spade finesse is going to win. Because if you take away a king, instead of having 11, he'll have eight. I think that's too light for them. Yeah, even with the singles and spade, that's too light for them. So he's got all three kings. Probably has the queen of hearts as, as well. So I'm going to set up my diamonds. I hope he pops up with the king when I lead the next one. Pop up with the king would be really good. Okay. So the suit could be Five diamonds, four diamonds, two diamonds, two diamonds. Or it could be four diamonds, four diamonds, three diamonds. I'm going to just leave the club and see what's happening here. I'm thinking about ducking a club. Yeah, that. That was wrong. If 
West has two clubs. If he's 4-4 four, four in the main, he can't be 4-4-4-1 four, 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 anymore. So 4-3. Four, so he could be four diamonds and three diamonds over here or three diamonds over here uh, and four diamonds over here. So if it was three diamonds, I could have drawn, led to seven and dropped it. King, not the 10. But but anyway, um, what I'm going to do now is I'm probably going to just set up a long club. And yes, East will win this club. And if he returns a diamond, I get the jack of diamonds. If he returns a spade, that's my finesse I need. I get a good club. Which is another club. Spain, which is pitch another heart. We'll win that one. And we'll pitch our heart. Oh, the spade's going to be all good. And they get a heart at the end. Well, that's enough to move us up a little bit. We're still fourth. One, two, oh, okay. Second. I, I'm i okay with second. Well, this looks like a pass, being vulnerable. Not being vulnerable, I would open this, but I think I'll just pass. One heart. Oh. Well. I'm going to feign. I got really good clubs. Um, I, I, partner's got 11 points. I've got 11. He can't have more than 11. So when I bid two clubs, he's going to bid two hearts. But. If he's got really great shape, he might bid more aggressively. Say so he's got 11 points and seven hearts and five diamonds or something. So I'm going to show better than just a two heart raise, but I really just got a two heart raise. Well, we're done now. Well, we got two diamonds and a spade and four hearts. We can do a dummy reversal. We do we have the entries to our hand to rough three clubs? We might be able to set up a fourth diamond before they get spades going. West is not gonna be let's let's count the points. I got eleven, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So the twenty twenty and West has uh eleven, so we, we know. So East has nine. Just like we do. And they play king from ace king. So the king of clubs is over here. And if you had the ace jack. He might have played the jack instead of the ace. So the king jack of clubs is over here. Because you know it's usually best to insert. But, but that's not as sure. The, for sure the kings are in east. At least six of his nine, he's got it. So the ace of hearts is over here. Um, what I'm thinking about now is my dummy reversal. I'm going to rough two clubs in dummy. Rough, rough. So I take three hearts and two roughs is five. And the ace of diamonds is six. The king of diamonds is seven. And the ace of spades is eight. Making on the nose. Is there anything better? I still might get a fourth diamond, but I'm going to lose two spades, a club, and a heart. Two spades. Anyway, we're going to rough this one. Now I'm going to just rough it a little big. There's the jack. I'm surprised he didn't play it. Rough it a little bit big. I got plenty of time to get over here and rough uh, the queen of clubs. 
maybe I'll just come over right, right now. Um, you know, when the ace leaves a spade, it hit your two spades. I'd rather strip their diamonds. I'll tell you what. They can't stop me from roughing two clubs. I'm going to eliminate the spades. Just in case. As soon as Ace Doubleton, he's going to be in play here, perhaps. I need to rough the club. I need to get this in. I probably should have played low. I need to get this in. Maybe, what club is he to be in? A Doubleton club? Rough. Well, this is risky, but this is match points. Try to strip this last diamond out and get a rough in a slough. It's not very likely, but no, it didn't work. Well, we're back to our eight tricks. Well, not a bad score, though. We were trying to try to catch up for that stupid mistake on two. Well, I'm going to open this one a no trap, I guess. It's not a very good no trap hand. I need a swing. So, open a no trap. Uh, three. What's two hearts? Two hearts is something. Hearts in a minor. Again, usually five five, but they don't have to be. He doesn't say how long they have to be. Usually five five. That's negative double. Three diamonds. Well, that was a negative double. Doesn't promise a lot of stuff, so I guess I have to pass. Probably is a trump. Okay, so this is the same kind of hand as last time. We think the player's got five hearts and five clubs, I guess. Five hearts and five clubs. Partner will know that um, they don't give count, but there's no place for them to throw that club away. I'm going to get both of my club tricks. I'll just hide my queen for a second. Okay, so should I bang the ace of diamonds? And so let's think. Partner would have at least three diamonds for his negative double. And three clubs for his negative double. Well, we know we, we think he's got three clubs, despite his playing a nine. He's trying to win the trick, I guess. So if he's got... He doesn't have five spades. So partner has four spades. So the clearer has three spades. The clearer has five... Because if partner had five spades, he could just bid two spades. Declare has five hearts, presumably from the bidding, and five clubs, presumably from the bidding. So he's out of diamonds. So we need to set up our spade trick. Or maybe spade tricks, depending on partner's got good spades. So we're going to return a spade. <coughs> Ace of diamonds would be rough, probably. <coughs> and then he could have thrown away spades on his good clubs. Hopefully we can get some spades here. Oh, partner screwed us up. He should have cashed his spade king. Oh, we played spectacular defense. Our partner let us down. I should have high load in spades, so he thinks I'm the one with the doubles in spade. I screwed that up. I could have played that better. If I'd have led the seven of spades, not the two, if I'd have led the seven of spades, then played the two of spades, he'd have given me a, he'd have led that last spade, I guess, trying to give me a spade rough. Now he's going to rough the spade. Eventually he's going to rough a spade. 
There it is. All right, well, we defended it well from our side of the table. Partner let us down, but we could have defended it better. I misdefended. So what I need to do here is lead the seven of spades. The logic was right. Um, make this bigger. Next, 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 next. So the logic of, of what the, the the distribution was right. I overtook the king in case he was. Uh, well, it didn't matter if he got a singleton. Previous, but if I had a high load, partner might have cashed the king to try to give me a rough and finesse. Yeah, he thought I had the jack six. I don't know. High low, he might have continued spades. But the logic of switching to the spade was sound. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next week.